back in the mining city and MTN's Dom Tibbetts tells us how the Butte miners plan to make the most of a saved summer season. Yeah, I guess the first thing that comes to mind is being thankful and, and you know, we preach that to the kids is there's a lot, you're right, there's a lot of people that aren't able to play right now and uh, we got the okay to, to start our games next weekend. We're, we're extremely excited and can't wait to get out there and, and compete and have a little bit of fun. The Butte Silverbow Health Department finally gave the Butte Miners the go-ahead to officially start their season this upcoming Saturday, which for seniors like Ryan Wall will make a world of a difference as he prepares to take his talents to the next level. Just seeing live play so much different than practice, doesn't even matter if it's like a scrimmage, just being facing people that you're not used to playing against and different arms and that different skill sets just it's eye-opening. Wall isn't the only Ryan on the team that will use this season to sharpen their skills for college. The University of Mary will welcome in his teammate Ryan Burt and for the six foot six senior it's a dream come true. Paper to oh, it, was, it was awesome. It, it, it was always a goal of mine to play college baseball and now that's actually happening I'm really excited. Burt will head into next season trying to make his way into the Marauders pitching rotation. Wall will try to do the same for the Jimmies, an opportunity that didn't seem likely just two months ago. But both Ryans will lead the way for the Miners this season, helping restore a sense of normalcy back to the Mining City sports scene. In Butte, Dom Tibbetts, MTN Sports. For the Miners host Kalispell Saturday in a doubleheader at Three Legends Field. First pitch is at 1 o'clock in the afternoon.